Hi guys, Yuri here again. Welcome to YB Plays Music. Today we are going to end off the basic minor chords with the G M or the G minor chord. So we already did all the basic major chords, and now it's the last one from all the basic minor chords. So for the G minor chord, again similarly to the C M chord, in the first way to play the G chord, we don't have an easy way to change that one to a minor chord, all right? So we actually have to start off again with the second way to play the G M chord, or the G chord rather, uh, and make that a minor chord. So the second way to play the G chord was here with my index finger over all the strings and then play it like this. If you want to see on how to play this chord in detail, then click this video above you can see how I play the G chord in different positions over there. So, but that's one of them. And to make this a minor chord, we just remove the middle finger, which sounds like this. And that's the G minor chord, the G M chord. All right. Now, the second way to play this one, again, we are going to start off with the second way to play the F minor chord we did last week. And that was right here on the eighth fret with my index finger like this. And just move two frets down the arm. And again, we get the G minor. Okay, so those are the two most common ways to play it. I have another way to show you guys, but it's similar to the less common ways to play the E minor and the F minor chords that we did last week and the week before, which for the F minor chord was in this position. So, you got the four fingers on a different position and just move that up two frets down the arm and we get the G minor chord. So those are a couple of ways to play the G M or the G minor chord. Now, we already did all the basic major and minor chords, but we actually have some more to go. You might have noticed in some videos where we use similar positions, but just move down the arm for the next uh, chord. Sometimes we have to move one fret up, sometimes we have to move two frets up. Now, in the case that we move two frets up, we actually skip one chord in between. So those are the ones that I'm going to show you guys from next week on. So definitely stay tuned for those ones. I hope you learned something again today. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share the video. Also don't forget I have reaction videos and music videos for you guys to check out. Thank you very much and see you guys next time. Bye.